And we're getting more breaking news on the broadcast and this is to do with the probe panel's report in the Hathra stampede incident. Now that report has been submitted and it has held the satsang organizers and local administration responsible for the incident. This report doesn't rule out a conspiracy and recommends in-depth investigation. In fact, uh, uh, more details are flying in thick and fast when it comes to the probe panel's report that's been uh, submitted as far as the Hathra stampede incident is concerned. Uh, for those details, let me take this across to my colleague Anvit, who has brought us all of those inputs. Anvit, I do not see the mention of uh, the Baba's name in this probe panel as well. So what happens next after they are saying that uh, a conspiracy cannot be ruled out and there needs to be in-depth investigation? See, Baba's name has not been mentioned because his name has uh, not been mentioned in the FIR in the first place. And uh, we uh, had put this question to UP Chief Minister Yogi Ajnath as well as to Shalab Mathur, who is the IG and who did a press conference after this entire incident. And both of them made similar statements saying that as and when the, 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 uh, the, the investigation widens further and uh, uh, many more statements of those who have been arrested are recorded. Based on the evidence that is collected and if those evidence point out at the uh, at the Baba and his negligence at his part, then his name will be included and his uh, interrogation will also be done. Uh, they have not ruled out, however, that he will be questioned in this case. But uh, the main thing right now is that uh, the, the police have maintained since the beginning and the SIT chief uh, ADG Agra, uh, Anupam Kulshed, when we spoke to her, she also uh, said to CNN News 18 that the focus right now is to make initial arrests and find out the negligence and fix accountability. Hmm. Uh, if we are talking about this report that has been submitted, the key factor, the key takeaways from this report I would mention are that the report uh, very seriously says that it does not rule out any conspiracy angle hmm. and has recommended an in-depth investigation hmm. which is being done by a three committee member, uh, three member committee that has been set up. Uh, other than that, <clears throat> you see they, they have gone on to say that uh, this incident occurred uh, purely due to negligence and uh, the negligence has been on part of administrators as mm. well as on the part of organizers. Mm. The, the report makes this clear. Uh, other than that, uh, they have also said that uh, based on the investigation, uh, as far as the legal action is uh, or you know the disciplinary action is concerned, six uh, officers have been uh, placed under suspension. This include SDM, uh, the circle officer, the Hasildar, station officer of Sikandra Rao, where the incident took place, the Chalky in charge of Kachora and the Chalky in charge of Pora have also been suspended. But uh, see, if we talk about the accountability, uh, accountability has been fixed both on administrators as well as on organizers. Hmm. Uh, for administration, it is, uh, for administrative official, it is that uh, uh, the committee has found that the program organizers and tehsil level police uh, and administrative officers, they have been found guilty and they have been found responsible for negligence in performing their duties. Also, it has been said that they did not inform about the event of this magnitude to their senior officials. The flow of information was not as it should have been. Okay. Other than that, the, sub, the district magistrate of Sikandra Rao had granted permission for the event without inspecting the venue or without making sure that adequate arrangements are being put in place by the organizers. These are the accountabilities that the report says on the part of administration. Other than that, if we talk about the organizer, it clearly mentioned that the organizers obtained permission for the event by concealing facts. Hmm. Uh, the condition applicable for permission were not followed. Hmm. Individuals who had been added to the organizing committee was done before without any police verification. And also that the organizers who were involved uh, they uh, the accident that uh, occurred after that the members the organizing committee members had fled the spot and did not wait there to make any necessary arrangements or uh, felt it responsible to inform the police in time right and with the fact that you're mentioning that the local administration and even the local police for that matter failed to take this entire event seriously the pictures of which we are constantly flashing on the screens the people can see the gamut of uh, assembly over there that is the number of crowd and the number of people who were assembled to actually listen to the baba despite this huge gathering there was no cognizance uh, not ample security put in place and uh, all of this will be accounted for when it comes to this in-depth investigation that's been sought? Yeah, certainly. See, this uh, security point of view is also mentioned in the report. Uh, they have gone on to say that the organizing committee misbehaved with the police and not just this, but an, an, uh, it also attempted to prevent the local police from inspecting the program venue. So uh, even uh, before the event, the permission was not taken, the police was not involved. 
and even after the incident the police was prevented from entering the venue and to, from doing an, a detailed inspection so this certainly amounts to uh, grave violations not just on the part of administration but also on the part of organizing committee one more thing that the uh, officers had previously told in a news routine is that uh, even when the, the permission of only 80000 people were taken mm. and then when the crowd started to swell and it went up to 2.5 lakh as it is mentioned in the fir that has been filed on the complaint of a police officer then even then the organizers did not feel it important mm. to update the local administration and also on part of local administration it is a failure of the liu local intelligence unit or the local administrators that they could not estimate that the numbers could rise or have increased during the event when the uh, when this uh, uh, thing was going on also and with the fact that this report also mentions that organizers involved in this entire event were did not even have the proper police verification what is the usual precedence what are uh, the the checks in place that need to be followed uh, and the, the ones that were flouted see whenever such a you know mass gathering is conducted by any organizing committee you have to inform the administrators and the police that what is the event how many people are there who are the people in the organizing committee what measures are being placed what is the estimated number of crowd and what is what uh, arrangements are being put in place be it security arrangements or the arrangements related to uh, managing the crowd however all these were uh, violated the police was not informed in time the, the, the number of people who were informed the gathering that was estimated was only of 80000 however it swelled up to 2.5 lakhs on which has been placed on record despite that the admission was not informed in time other than that police, uh, the report also mentioned that security measures were not in put in place barricading was not done routes of exit and entry were not proper so people when this uh, when the stampede uh, was set hmm. off hmm. people were confused and it was a haywire situation that people did not know where to go and that was the only reason because the mismanagement uh, is the only reason why this uh, incident took place and the toll that toll particularly went up to as high as 121 All right thank you so much for that uh, Anvit and